Hello, I'm Raul Domingo. I'm the managing director of uh, Heat Ex Equipment Philippines Corporation, and I'm based in the Philippines. Hi, I'm Luis Ang, and I'm from Singapore. I'm from Perfex International. So I'm the CEO of Perfex International. Uh, the company uh, services uh, the emergency power industry for all its cooling requirements, whether it's for new projects, special projects, uh, uh, reconditioning of old uh, cooling systems. Right, right. We, we offer those services and uh, we're looking at uh, brisk uh, uh, business in the Philippines as uh, you know, uh, the emergency power business here is uh, very much expanding. And what about you, sir? Uh, could you describe about your company? What do you do here in the Philippines? My company is uh, Perfex uh, Internationals, Private Limiters, and we come from Singapore. Uh, Perfect is the name, heat transfer is my game. So what we do is uh, we are into the heat exchangers uh, industries. So we do radiators, we do shell and tube uh, for heat exchange, and this is our industry. These our partners in Philippines. Right. So you distribute all the products of uh, Mr. Yes. Louis here. Yes, we do that. So tell us more about Heatex equipment. What are the other products that you are selling? Well. Uh, Apart from what uh, my good friend Louis uh, mentioned, uh, our specific market actually is for the uh, power generation business. So we service their cooling systems, uh, uh, also their uh, other special projects for steel for the for, the, for their cooling uh, requirements. We also offer uh, servicing using special chemicals, which we are. Uh, using for for cleaning uh, uh, old uh, cooling systems uh, like heat exchangers, radiators. So we do those uh, uh, services for, for our clients. And what's our business expectation for probably, let's talk about 2019. What do you look forward to in the Philippines and in Asia? What do you look forward to? Well, here in the Philippines, uh, I'm sure you know that there's a construction boom. Yes. So a lot of uh, buildings are being put up. Yes. And along with these buildings, there are new generators. Mm -hmm. And of course, old existing buildings also, they have their old generators, which they would probably refurbish, recondition, mm -hmm. or probably change uh, for, for new generators. Well, our look for 2019 is good because uh, especially in ASEAN countries, so there's a lot of uh, infrastructure developments in, in uh, this uh, Malaysia, Thailand, uh, Philippines itself, okay, even Indonesia. So I think for 2019 it's going to be a good year for, for these uh, power generation industries.